Welcome to this reading vlog. Hello. Um, I thought I should add some talking in here. Just maybe. Um, I am about to get ready for bed. <laughs> My hair is ridiculous. <laughs> so it's um, almost hair washing day. And so I've got it all just up here like this. Yeah, so I thought I should um, add some talking to this reading vlog, maybe. Um, I literally, yes, yes, I did literally only just start this reading vlog because it was raining yesterday and I just got some footage and I was like, yes, it's cute. We're going to use it and roll with it, whatever. I'll only do it for like to the end of this weekend because I still have like an October vlog and who knows if this vlog is going to be up before this one I literally do not know um because I filmed like over a week's worth of footage and I just have no motivation or time to really um to edit it so this one's not going to go for too long hopefully I always say this and I always say that ah! um so I am technically in the middle between and the I'll start again. I'm technically in the middle of two books. They're both blue-ish. This one's more of a teal. This one's definitely just a blue. Um, yeah, I'm in the middle of two. So we've got Never Tell by Catherine Orton. Yeah, Catherine Orton. 
and then we've got Watch Over Me by Nina LaCour. That is for Sage's Book Club. Has it got a name? No, I just think it's Sage's Patreon Book Club. Yes. So this is January's read. And um, January ends tomorrow. <laughs> and I've read two chapters. I'm on page 16. It's, this month's been um, quite hectic in terms of um, work. I visibly look tired, but um, also I've, I never take my mascara off because it's my eyeliner and mascara off because it's truly a pain to get it off. And then I end up turning myself blind. Half of my face ends up having black smears all of it because it doesn't come off properly. I don't use makeup wipes. I have like a makeup removing pad. But I can't be bothered cleaning them also. It does take a lot of water to clean. So I just use a face washer and get off all of the powder. Anyway, this is a reading blog, not talking about makeup. Anyway, so last night I had dinner with a couple of my best friends. We haven't seen each other in such a long time. So they gave me... Um, <laughs> they gave me my Christmas birthday present last night and one of it one part of it was this <laughs> I've been wanting this so badly and um we were gonna get it ordered in at work but I try to not prioritize again penguin books penguin books smell good I don't know what it is this one's not as strong as um Girl, woman, other. Is that the title of that? Yes. I, yeah. Okay. Um, it doesn't smell as strong. But yes, this has been on my, um, my want to read list for a very, very, very long time. And now I finally have a copy. Thank you guys. <laughs> um, and then my mum came home from her trip to Tasmania and she was like, I'm not getting anyone presents. Sends me a message during her trip. I got you a present. <laughs> she got me this. That's upside down and backwards. How cute is this? It's, this is, okay, this comes up backwards and I don't know if I know how to edit these. It says 365 days, days of art in nature. So it's kind of like one of those prompt books where it gets you to do stuff like art wise. And I think the whole point is to do it in the book, but I don't know if I want to do it in the book and just start a sketchbook aside from it. Although this one seems very specific because it says draw the craters of the moon, um, but that's pretty much all I draw. So. <laughs> uh, draw fossils onto these stones. So maybe some of the stuff I'll have to recreate in a sketchbook, but one, some of the space doesn't feel like enough space for me. Uh, two, I don't want to ruin the book potentially. Three, um, could be regifted, but also like some of the stuff is just like this entire page, and it's just like, wait, so do I just have to do it on a separate piece of paper or do it on top of? And it's just like, might as well just have a separate sketchbook. Um, then these things can be done over and over again. Anyway, um, oh, what's this color wheel here? Ah, create my own color wheel by adding in the colors below. You can use any material you like, but it may be easier to mix colors with paint, such as acrylic or gouache. I don't know why it would want me to create a color wheel when it's just a color wheel. Anyway, all right, um... I don't know how much reading I'll get done tonight because, one, I have a headache. Two, um, I'm trying to figure out how to fix all of my video friggin' problems. 
So I'm trying to upload my knitting bitch, but it's not working at the moment. Um, hopefully it is uploaded by this, by the time this goes up, um, because I can't get the footage off of my iPad, so I edited it, edited it on the iPad, but I can't export it from the iPad because there's not enough space. Then, um, my laptop is just not working at the moment. So I'm dealing with those problems tonight and watching one of my favourite shows called Wolf Blood. I'm loving it for like the third, fourth, fifth, sixth time. I don't know. I've lost count. I love it too much. Anyway, um, see ya from tonight. I don't know when next. I'm trying to get it this weekend to be productive. Yeah, anyway, bye.